My name is Anda Tlongo. I'm from Eastern Cape, originally from Eastern Cape, but here in Cape Town, I'm from Kairich. So in 2015, I was working in City ICC as a bartender. Then I think that's where my interest for wine started. Then luckily I had a friend that was studying in Stellenbosch, so I told him I'm interested in winemaking and he applied for me then. Boom, like here I was here in Elsenberg. No, my family was not um, a wine lover and stuff like that. So yeah, I'm grateful to my family that they allowed me to pursue my dreams and to do what I wanted to do. Um, I would say I'm someone who doesn't give up because the reason why um, I started in Elsenberg in 2015 but then I couldn't finish at the exact time. I didn't be able to do that three years. So I failed the module. So I had to do seller management first instead of doing seller technology. So for me, when I look at my journey back from 2016, I'd say it was a disappointment to my family not finishing in the, in the exact time doing that three years. But as well, at the same time, it was a blessing in disguise because I was able to come out with two degrees within five years because I started with seller management, graduated with seller management, then I did seller technology. So for me, with my first year, I'm actually at, um, in Salt River with uh, Savage Wines with Duncan. Um, as you know, I graduated in the year where was, um, COVID was spiking up, the numbers were spiking up, so I didn't have enough time to spend in the cellar or enough time to to attend classes, everything was done online visually. We had to attend our classes on Zoom and everything. So when I started at Savage Wines, I started, as, I knew that I had to start with hard work. I have to pull up my socks. I have to do up everything as according to what it was supposed to be meant. You can, you can study or whatever, anything, but if you don't have experience, if you don't have exposure, if you're not communicating, you're not socializing with people, then it's, the degree is some sort of like useless to you. So what stood out for me from Duncan the most was that you must pay attention to, attention to detail in everything that you do. Respect, discipline, traveling around the world, tasting some wines, developing your, your palate. It plays a big role as well. South Africa, we know is a rainbow nation, quite a lot of people around here. But yeah, the wine industry, even through everything, it, kind of like unites all of us and brings out the best of South Africa.